Hello all, wanted to show you an interesting demo from our attackdefense.com labs. So in this demo, what you'll see is you will be able to work with a full-blown GUI system and play with Wireshark. So this is a challenge called Dumb Assassin in which you're doing Wi-Fi forensics. Uh, as soon as you know you start the challenge, this goes ahead, spins up a completely dedicated instance for you in which you can practice this lab. And what you're going to see is this has a full-blown GUI and it'll pretty much be Wireshark delivered through the web browser. So there we go, the lab has started. Click on the lab link. And this connects to your private URL. This is a completely random URL uh, which is dynamically generated every single time you spin a lab. So now we are connecting to our lab instance and voila, there you go. We have a full-blown GUI system over here with Wireshark and Wireshark already has the file inside it. So based on whatever the challenge actually says over here, uh, you can go ahead and try different things. So as an example, again, I'm not necessarily solving the challenge but rather just want to show you some stuff. So you can literally look at Wireshark the way you would on your desktop. You can apply filters. So let's say, I'm going to say, and not selected so that we see everything apart from beacon frames. We see that it's actually working through Wireshark. This is actually a reasonably big trace file, around 150,000 packets. Uh, now we can actually scroll through the packets again, just like we would on a local system. Uh, let's actually try and increase font size a bit. So I'm gonna go over here, fonts and colors. The key thing I'm trying to show you is uh, how seamless the whole experience is. Uh, pretty much feels like you are operating Wireshark on your desktop. And again, this little time taken is actually it going ahead and applying it to all packets. This is a delay on Wireshark side. Uh, now, if you wanted like a much more higher resolution, you can go to monitor settings and set this to, let's say 1080p, apply. And now, go back to your Wireshark instance. There you go. You have a much more high scale responsive screen, right? Fantastic. So this is the very first GUI lab that we are putting out. I'm going to stop this. So once you finish uh, working with this instance, you can stop it. So this is the very first GUI lab. Uh, and we are going to put in a lot of more labs which just look like this. So what is the real advantage? Well, you didn't have to go ahead and start a new instance of Wireshark locally, install tools, and all of that stuff. The best part. Uh, you want to go ahead and start the lab once again. All you have to do is hit play again, wait for the 25 seconds, and you should have a brand new instance. Now, because as I mentioned, everything is delivered through the browser, you can access this from your office whenever you have you know, a couple of minutes of break time. There is no VPN requirement, which means no firewall hassles and nightmare, or no worries that you're probably putting your office machine or laptop on an insecure network. Uh, so there you go, kind of go ahead, launch a new lab all within 25 seconds time. And this will spin up a brand new instance for you. And you should be able to begin with the labs uh, pretty much anytime, anywhere, coffee shop, you know, home, office, wherever. So I hope you guys like this demo. Uh, Pentester Academy students can already access this. People who are subscribing and going on the beta list will have access very soon later this month. So please join the beta. Thank you.